Hello everybody, it's your boy Ikarosu Sasaki, and today we are talking about art theft. Yes, you heard it right, art theft. So I would one like to take the chance to say, don't go harass this person. Do not send them hate mail. Do not send them hate threats. I'm not telling you to go do any of that shit. Do not mess with this person. Just do what you think is right. What I'm going to do is I'm going to report them. So this person, bring it up. And I really wish I had Jarvis. Now that'd be cool if I had a Jarvis bot. All right. So I would like to say one that this person, Zoe, is someone that I, at first I thought was a very nice person. I didn't really think them of, you know, as very much of a bad person because they were actually willing to, you know, reach out to me, talk to me, and actually try to get to know me, which is exactly what it kind of started off as. Um, ask questions, so on and so forth. And then we get to the juicy part where then we talk about uh, the model. Now the thing is, I'm not going to go too much in detail, but a lot of changes happening in April. And they were wondering if I was selling my uh, model. And one, I told them no. And two, I was not allowed to do that because my model itself. Um, I am not the one who uh, made the model, rigged it. I'm not the one who did any of that. So this model was given to me by my friend. And with that being the case, um, it got into a little bit more questionable territory, like I'm required selling it. So forth. And I was like, you know, it's a memorable thing. And then it kind of get even more where it's just like, I mean, it's my first 2D model. I have, uh, it's so memorable. That's pretty much where I said that. Um, that's so nice of you. Why are you getting a new model? I told them why. And so then they say, hey, I also have some amazing model I've drawn. Would you like to see? I said, sure. And then these were the images that were given to me. And so I was like, you know what? These are pretty cool. However, in my mind, it was saying, hey, something doesn't make sense didn't make sense is like you know, one you got all this amazing art but then you have this you would think if you do some if you do amazing artwork you wouldn't leave this much detail out of the situation regarding um clothing or at least in my opinion i i don't think i could be wrong but then it, again it got into questionable territory and i said okay third one seems 3d i started questioning and they're like uh victor's original oc um, original OC as in someone commissioned it. Also, give me one minute. This is where I took the time out of uh, talking to then find out where all of this came from and who exactly it was. Um, turns out this person was named Huntress and she had people who did fan art with, uh, for them. Along with the uh, their model mother and um, Mother Rigger. I, I don't really know how much uh, those stuff goes in hand in hand. I'm not the one to ask that. Um, as an original OC, okay, give me one min. This is when I tried finding out. Turns out they also took credit for this as well. Um, and the ironic part is if you look closely, you'll see lines like this. Um, I don't know what that represents. All I know from what I understood is that this is one of those things where it's just like watermarks. Um, and so I got even more suspicious, looked him up. Turns out it was Huntress. Uh, apparently it was someone named Huntress. And I was like, okay, so I started talking to Huntress. Um, I asked him, you know, what was the one with the Fox Lady? Because uh, I wanted to see if, uh, you know, they would give what her name was. Uh, turned out she messed up the name purposely in order to try and avoid me finding the individual. Uh, I said, indeed, it's good work. They said, thank you so much for the kind words. Uh, so did you do that stuff, including rigging? Now, this is where I asked her. I was like, hey, did you do this? Did you provi like, provide this for that client? I said, why'd you ask? Again, I didn't want to seem suspicious. So I said, I just want to know uh, just in case something's wrong or rigged or if I want to get a pal, uh, one for my pal. I said, haha, yeah, I'm the one who made these fires. Ah, cool. 
They said, yep, I want to suggest something to you. Sure. What is it? And this is when Spectre um, got back to me. And uh, the message I sent to the them, or her, them, uh, was, hey, I wanted to give you a heads up. Someone's uh, contacted me saying that they do 2D modeling or, or rigging. And I wanted to give you a heads up saying someone is claiming that they are doing it. And sorry for the tongue twisters. I'm terrible at this. Um, thank you so much for letting me know. I've tried to contact them, but they have been extremely difficult. I'm going to let my model mother know along with the artist through this piece. And so I showed them more evidence. Uh, they said, thank you for these. Uh, am I okay to use these screenshots in case I need to take this any further? I may need to send these to the artist that they are stealing from. I said yes, because I don't mind. Um, I said, I can also possibly find out what else she is stealing from. Uh, if that helps, because funny enough, if they do it once, they're not dumb enough to do it again, are they? You'll you'll see this very soon. Uh, I told her not to say anything to Zoe yet. Don't show her the pictures. Don't ask any questions for the information. That way I can keep getting more information out of them. And of course, uh, I don't plan to further have conversations with them. I've tried that reason with them. They are refusing to remind me of my content. I said, ah, see. Uh, don't worry, I'll do what I can. They said, really appreciate it. I said, bingo, found one. So it turns out the drawing, or not drawing, sorry, the picture or model that she drew, which is this one, was the one that she claimed. However, the one that Huntress, I showed Huntress, was the fact that this is not the case. It is someone named Shaharu, uh, comms are open, reopen i believe those are commissions um so i guess he does uh 3d and 2d rigging and uh creation which again i will get a hold of them uh when this video comes out because i was able to get a hold of some people um so i will be messaging this individual turns out you know obviously she stole it because it, it's there and so uh i sent them i said this is where i found their image originally came from the artist should be in this profile turns out he is the artist and this is where it was apparently it was a raffle thank you so much for 600 uh, followers it was out open to the public and what do you know you have the same image right here showing you know again and you wouldn't think it goes any further right wrong so we then went to her twitch which apparently he is taking her content and using it. Go to Instagram. Oh, she privated all her stuff. Well, it's a good thing I still have access to it um, through, you know, just having the page open. Turns out, you know, if you have the page open and you leave it there, if they private their uh, information, right, it you could still see it. So, as you can see, right, turns out looks like uh, a thumbnail of some sort. Uh, again, all this art is stolen. And again, not only just by this person, right? I even looked into this person, right? Took a while, but turns out their name is Doc Vivi. Now, I try getting a hold of them, but uh, I can't because well, it, I'll see what I can do regarding getting a hold of them, whether it's joining their Discord or something, but they do need to be aware that their art is being stolen and being claimed as someone else's, um, for that matter. And so I went even further. I was just like, okay, so further down the rabbit hole we go, right? We go further. Uh, later down these uh, messages, I was just like, okay, I went to then try and find her tweets, see if there was anything, uh, you know, in her Twitter, right? Turns out it was. This was another one that she claimed was hers. Now, this is off of a website. I tried finding it, but I could be wrong. It was very hard to try and find it. Um, but th this is what it was giving me. I clicked on the things, didn't really say anything, but with my current knowledge is it is on that website and there is a possibility she did steal it. Um, and so I went further down. I found a tweet of another 2D model named, 
uh, or sorry, I found a tweet of another model. And again, once more, here's your OC at this person. This is, it was nice working with you. Thanks uh, for the permanent share. Again, her claiming that the is her work. And what do you know? It is off of someone who is, you know, live at the moment, from what I understand. I did contact this person. I did inform them. Whatever actions they take, you know, they take. I just said, hey, you know, your model's being um, taken. Uh, I was like, hello, sorry for messaging you randomly. However, I would like to inform you that you inform you someone is claiming that your, your artwork is their own. I am doing an investigation regarding this person stealing other artworks and claiming that it's their own. Sorry that uh, I'm taking a bit of your time of your day in this matter, but I think it'd be the right thing to inform you about the matter. Um, what they decide to do is what they decide to do. And so right now, we are just trying our best to get information out there. Now, thankfully, um, Huntress was able to provide um, a link to the conversation that they had now, I'm not going to lie, the conversation, it, it's hard for me to sit there and be like, okay, which one's which, which one's ordered in which way. So, um, as organization wise, I'm not good with it. And I didn't really know which one was the first message, which one's the second one. Uh, you know, so we're, we're just going to go by this, right? So, uh, you mentioned exotic minks in your story, replied. I don't have anything now. I removed everything when I got a message uh, from a friend of mine, probably that friend of mine being me. Um, I apologize. Uh, I don't know. I need to get this per, uh, repost. Thank you for reaching out. Could you provide a screenshot to show me that you removed the content and unable to see the screen since it was uh, privated or you could unprivate just so that I can see. Then I will uh, remove the story post, even though I'm personally, I wouldn't advise it. Because, I mean, they're committing, you know, an act that they should be upheld for. But that is just me. All right. I'm, I may not be, you know, as, you know, nice as other people in some cases. Uh, I didn't do uh, that because you put the story. I removed it because you sounded like you got to get per uh, permission to post uh, up to you that you want to remove it. Story, not kindly to mention this notice on your account need to get permission to post your work otherwise you can fuck other people's in the same way she said to be honest uh it's common knowledge not to post content that doesn't belong to you nobody has to put this in their bio it has it is just standard you're wrong not everyone is like you the second model i post that person appreciates me publishing him uh i just would like to so post that i'm going to be keep posting whatever i like Sorry if this sounds rude, but you're not my enemy and I love making friends. Okay, we keep going. Sorry if this is, sounds rude, you're not my enemy. Oh, this is probably it. I will always welcome you as my friend. The fact that you privated your account in the moment and I messaged is proof enough that you know that you were in the wrong. In the end, this conversation, as we are not getting anywhere, but I will be sending the formal repost to Instagram. But I wanted to talk more. Can we become friends? Delete my content. Already did, honey. I delete my whole account. If you want, from what it looks like, this person wanted to. I can do. Uh, you had 31 posts when my content was there, so you haven't. I can delete my whole account if you want. I can do that. I'm not asking you to do that. That's your choice. I want my content removed, and I'm not stupid. I can still see the amount of posts go down. Not. It's important that you haven't provided the credit of your post to me, an artist who worked hard on the art. I'm gonna be honest, the artwork is really good. I enjoy it. it looks cool. Um, all I want is for us to just make friends. I can give you access to this account if you want to become my friend, honey. Delete my content. That's all I'm asking. And will you be my friend? Delete my account. That's or delete my content. That's all I'm asking. Are you able to do uh, do the voice note? I just can't understand you. No, delete my account uh, content account. I keep fucking saying that. Uh, don't call me. I will not answer. We are not friends. That just requires trust that you do not have any. You have stolen my content. You didn't answer me with my real 
account. I'm trying to talk to you from the last two months. Do you even check your DMs? Tell me how do I talk? I don't have any choices. If you're talking to me now. Just accept uh, MW. I don't know what that is. As your friend, I will can do whatever you want to take this account and delete it with your hand. All I want is your friendship. I contact account and delete it with uh, all I want just for your friendship. Delete my content only if you be my friend. Delete my content. Be my friend. Delete my content. Keep going. Uh, I'm just a fan, honey. Why don't you understand that? Hiya. Again, this is just very fucking pathetic behavior, in my opinion. So not only did she steal from uh, Huntress, but she also stole from Mookie VT. In addition to that, she also stole from Doc Vivi. Again, I I couldn't get a hold of them. So um, yeah, this video is here to pretty much say, hey, you know, make this be awareness. I'm gonna report the individual. And another thing, don't fucking DM me and ask me if I want anything. If you know for sure that you do create the content that you, you were providing. And it is really bad for you to sit there and false advertise to your customer of what you provide. Without further ado, everybody, that's probably going to be it. Um, this is just a rant video. Okay, I would like to take the time to say the artists will be who are responsible for the fan art and the um, uh, other stuff will be down below and uh yeah so be sure to go check them out go show them some love and support pretty sure it would mean the world to them and have a good day everyone